looking stark for a win. And we are set to go. A critical game for both sides here, and we are underway. The Predators have it behind the net. Looking for space inside the D zone. Got the puck at the defensive end. Passes up ahead from the left wing. Feeds it over to Krug. Couldn't complete the play. The Predators have it behind the cage. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Saros has the puck, and he'll wait for the faceoff. I think that's a pretty heady play. There's been a little bit of scramble around him, and he jumps on it. They could get reorganized. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Still looking for our first goal. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Here's a short pass to Yossi. Into the attacking area from the left side. Can't make the connection on the pass. Sends the pass in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. the left wing and into center. The Blues scoop it up along the boards. Angles it over to Thomas. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Tobin. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit and makes the save. Moves it to Kairou. Too many bodies in the way. And he takes the dish. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. He tries that extra move. I mean, sometimes it's okay. Sometimes you've got to just push the puck. He might have a step here. He's in all alone. Denies him on the breakaway. Moves the puck. Poked away in the neutral zone by Chanel. Nashville's got it in the neutral zone. Breakaway. This is a real strength of the goaltender, the one-on-one -on -one battle. He gets out, focuses in on the shooter, takes all the room away and makes the stop. And now it's grabbed by Johansson. Grabbed along the board by Barbashev. And just got a piece of it to keep it out. And he takes a shot. Saros gobbles up the puck and he'll wait for the whistle. Oh, now you got a chance to get organized again. The freezing is a good, safe play. Here in the late going of the frame, still no score in this one. Nice job tying up his opponent. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. The Predators have it against the wall. Passes it to Sanford. Across the line along the left wall. And now he moves it quickly to Glass. Pretty tough to come much closer than that, James. Nobody can score, but the posts aren't helping either. Yossi's got that send-it zone ability, which is when he throws a long breakout pass up the ice to get a teammate onto the attack. O'Reilly's quick draw zone ability means he has the edge in the face-off circle and can win possession for his side. One of these players is going to help give their team the upper hand tonight. Guys, back to you. Here's a shot. Oh, that has some heat on it. He makes the save. That'll do it for period number one. We'll drop the puck on the second period in just moments. Teams are back on the ice. Both squads gliding into position for the start of period number two. Both teams still feeling each other out as we are scoreless here to start the second. Great for all's between the bench. He scores! There's one from Philip Forsberg. Tenacity finally earns themselves the one goal lead. Now be a little cocky. Play like a front runner. You've got the lead. You've worked hard for it. 
The Blues get a hold of the puck off the draw. There's the whistle as the puck goes out of play. Lots of time left in this period. Nashville's ahead, 1-0. St. Louis will go to work as they win the draw. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Taken by Duchesne. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Pass to O'Reilly. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. Puck scooped up by Yossi. Here they come. Down the left side on the attack. Dumps it in. Krug's lugging the puck. Nashville's got possession at center. Duchesne's picking up steam. Moves it quickly over to Fabro. St. Louis gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Quick feed to Krug. Tarasenko's got the puck. Manages to hang on. Quick pass to O'Reilly. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Tarasenko. Centering feed! And he denies that great opportunity there. More than half the period left to play. The Predators lead it 1-0. And there's a little help from your friends right there from off the wing coming up with the puck. Peddington's gonna slow things down and up for the whistle. Well, you gotta kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. The Predators will go to work here in the offensive zone. Nashville's got it now. Here's a short pass to Kairou. Takes the feed. Across the line and on the attack. Moves it to Shen. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. Carrier's got a hold of the puck behind the net. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Drives it to the crease. Puck grabbed by Niederreiter. And that was a good heads up read to make that save. And that's knocked away by Saad. The Blues get a hold of the puck along the boards. On the skate and scores! You can have a bounce off the skate, James, but look at that. They wave this off. This looks like a kicking motion that's ruled by the referee. and he didn't let him out. Steps inside. Here's a pass in front. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Beatington's gonna hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James, he needed a cover there. Getting into the later stages of this period, we got a tie game. Browns won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. Takes the feed and center and moves up ahead. And the puck leaves the zone. And that pass doesn't go. And that concludes the second period of play. Still one more period of regulation time. We'll see what happens in the third next. Side 
Ring Ray Ferraro between the benches. I'm James Sabalski, ready to bring you period number three. The next goal will be a critical one as we are still tied, getting underway here in the third. Scooped up along the wall by Forsberg. Moves it quickly over to Granlin. And a good, solid hit on that play. Oh, and he just got enough of that one to keep it out. There's always a next level to making a save. Step two is get the puck out of danger. He does a nice job there. Pass out front. Picked off in front. Saros is on top of the puck, stopping the play. Looks like he's seen enough. The potential to start running around in your zone causes him to cover the puck up. Lots of time left in this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Johansson's won it in their own end. The Blues gain control of the puck against the wall. Sends the feet in front, and that's stopped. The Predators get a hold of the puck in their own end. Niederreiter's got it against the boards. Hammers the shot, grabs the puck in the slot. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Bennington. It's a really good save, in tight. He shuts down the area where the puck can go by getting out onto the puck, and there's nowhere for the shooter to put it. And he regains control of the puck. Can't make it work. Nashville's in now. Feeds the puck over to Letty. Can't find his man. Picked up along the boards by Thomas. Right up the gut, here they go. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Kairou. St. Louis looks to move the puck from their own end. Been a couple times tonight, James. I thought this game was going to stretch out, but it's not. And it's not going anywhere. This is how this league has become with the parity in. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. And he slides it quickly to Letty. Stones him in front. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. Just slide to the net. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Picked up along the wall by Echo. Great reach with the stick by Achari. Couldn't make that one happen. The Blues scoop it up along the boards. Center into the middle. Couldn't complete the pass. Up along the wing. Key to the middle. Great defensive play to pick off the pass. We got a delayed penalty coming up here as the ref's hand goes up in the air. And the play is whistled dead, and here's the call. Even though he's not very happy here, James, I don't really know what his defense is. That's a penalty to me. Can they capitalize on the power play as they step in for the faceoff? They'll get a chance on the power play for the very first time. They spent some time this morning working on it. Gets it out of his own end. Nashville's got a hold of the puck. Handles the pass. Moves it to the middle. And a new pass. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. The Predators will serve two for slashing. Who had the better night? Carlin is standing by. Yossi's been able to contribute by generating scoring chances, and you know his teammates appreciate it. I think he's been the player that stood out for me, guys. Puck picked up by Yossi. Up the neutral zone now. The centering pass in front. Off the stick, and they can't complete the play. Yeah, the officials didn't like that. The arms were in the air. Here comes the official's decision. A little bit like a hooking penalty. You're not going to get called for slashing if your stick's on the ice. A little more room out there with a little four-on-four. Four. Lots of puck support, four-on-four. Four. Get over close to your players so you can move the puck quickly. See if you can catch the other guys out of position. The Predators have it in the offensive zone. Gives them nothing in front. 
Biddington's going to hang on and just let things settle down for a moment. He really didn't have many options to play the puck, but no. in a close game, you want to be sure every time you do. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a faceoff? Duchesne's got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. And that's blocked. And now it's grabbed by Neighbors. Under a minute to go here in regulation time. Taken by Scantella. Scores! Look at this! The time has been shattered. They've got the goal in the Kept grinding at the game, and eventually you hope you're going to be the one to get the best chance. They get it, finish it, and now they've got the lead. O'Reilly's gained possession inside the neutral zone. Game position. And he slides it quickly to Forsberg. And now he moves it to Duchesne. Handles it along the blue line. And he makes the save on that play. Bennington's not had many moments to breathe tonight. He's faced a heck of a lot of dangerous chances. Been busy from almost the opening drop of the puck. He's given his team a chance to win. Oh, the home team is reeling here inside the defensive zone. And the fans are nervous. A chance to clear here! And they succeed in getting it out! Shen's ready to join the play. St. Louis converts shorthanded, but the man's back out of the ice. We're back to even strength. And that's all she wrote on this one as we are in the books. One looks feeling ecstatic after that one, but boy, how deflating is that for the other side? You just don't get many chances to come back to the series. They had their spot down to one. But now, the winner goes up 3-1 to one and a commanding lead in the series. That'll do it for break side here this evening from all of us here at EA Sports. My name is James Sabalski. Playoff hockey is simply the best. And we'll see you at the next postseason game. Cheers.